Hey guys, it's KevyDog4, and this is my conference finals game 4 overall highs and highlights video. So for the overall highs between these two games, Russell Westbrook had 36 points for the Thunder. Biznak Biombo had 14 rebounds for Toronto. Russell Westbrook had 11 assists. Andre Robertson had 5 steals for the Thunder. Biznak Biombo from the Raptors and Kevin Durant from the Thunder each had 3 blocks. And each team had a representative for 3-pointers. They all had 4 Channing Fire... Channing Fry from Cleveland, Kyle Lowry from Toronto, Clay Thompson from Golden State, and Russell Westbrook from Oklahoma City. So those four guys each had four three-point shots made, so every team had someone that had a, le a leader in that category. So I'm going to go over the highlights for um, the Eastern Conference Finals Game 4 first, followed by the Western Conference Finals Game 4. So for Cleveland versus Toronto, well, Cleveland did not play very strong in the first half, let's just say, because they were taking way too many three-point shots. I don't know why. They had 22 three-point shots. Only three of them went in in the first half. That was, I don't know why. They just kind of relied on the three-point shot a lot in the first two series, and then they went cold, and then they just kept trying to go for it, and it wasn't working, but they didn't change anything. In games three and four, this was the case in both of them. They were shooting way too many outside shots. So Kyle Lowry was strong in the first half, eight, eight for 11 in the first half, and Toronto had a huge lead by the end of the first half. I mean, they started out strong. They just got stronger, just... Really good first half for Toronto. Cleveland, in the fourth quarter, ended up taking the lead. But it was brief. And in the last minute and 30 seconds, the Raptors ended up pulling away. And Lowry and DeRozan had 67 points combined in this game. And Bismack Biombo had another strong game with 14 rebounds. So, Kevin Love, not a very good performance once again. And Kyrie Irving was back to his normal self. He was very good. But Kevin Love, no, not so much. So, for the Golden State versus Oklahoma City game, Oklahoma City, like Toronto did, they started out huge in the first quarter. And um, they had a 16 to nothing run in the first quarter, so that sparked it. And then Golden State started to come back in the late like at the end of the first quarter, so the Thunder run was in the probably early to mid first quarter, and at the end of the quarter, Golden State went had an 11 to two run, and then Thunder responded in the second quarter and went on a big run, and that was in the mid second quarter. Russell Westbrook, he had 21 points and nine assists in the first half. And Clay Thompson in the third quarter started to bring it back a little bit. He had 19 straight points for a Golden State. But they never, I don't think they ever made it all the way back. But then it was close for a while, but then the Thunder pulled away for good in the fourth quarter. So that's what happened in those two games. Thanks for watching. Um, in my next video, I will talk about... In my next three videos, I will talk about the conference finals, game five. So make sure you go back and watch any videos that you missed. If you missed some of my videos, because they've been very, I've been very sporadic in the way I've posted these, and I'm still behind. But game sixes are over, so I'm only two games, six videos behind, which would be very easy to catch up as long as I don't like it distracted like I did yesterday because I said I'd have this video up within one to two hours and it's 24 hours later. So thanks for watching this video and I will see you in my game five and six recap and highlight and overall highs videos whenever they go up. So thanks for watching.